It's boring time. Wait, wait, no, no, no. Okay, I was eventually gonna have to do this video. <laughs> I promised it and you guys hit the light target. So, here we are. <laughs> but, there are a couple of rules with this. Number one is, I promise you, this is not bored. This is just a silly, silly little, like, what does my friends taste like? <laughs> kind of, kind of goofy video, I guess. <laughs> I'm, I'm not, I'm just digging myself a bigger hole here, aren't I? But the other one is, this is just my silly little opinion, so if you guys don't like the food I say you taste like, then please do not get offended. What a sentence to say. <laughs> but anyway, we've got a whole of fuzzies to get through, so let's get started. First up, we have Coda Wolf. Okay, so Coda's a really difficult one because Coda's unbelievably sweet. They're very adorable. And, I don't know, they've got like their little expression, they're always cheery and happy, but they're also extremely small. <laughs> like, um, when on VR chat, you can notice like the height difference is like so short and it's very adorable. So it needs to be, it needs to be a food that's quite short. <laughs> and I'm trying to think of any short food. Um, you know what, you know what, I think, I think Coda would taste like a cheesecake. Like, a nice... A nice cheesecake. <laughs> uh, just because I feel like um, whenever whenever you have a dessert and there's cheesecake on the menu, you can never be unhappy. Okay, yeah, right. Uh, uh, tell me, tell me if you've found somebody who gets unhappy with the cheesecake and present them to me. Okay, okay. Is this what this is what this is gonna be like, right? <laughs> Next up we have Aero Proto. Okay, so being a protogen, I guess. I mean, the easy answer would be like they taste like, like motherboards, <laughs> like motherboards, um, and oily. <laughs> I, I feel like so many people are gonna get angry at me. Uh, yeah. So I think the easy answer would be mother motherboard and um oil. But what we'd say is with the blue, uh, with the blue ears. And like the, the kind of blackish roundabouts. I can imagine it being like a mix of like dragon fruit and um and like blueberries or something like that. So like um maybe ah actually okay a blueberry and dragon fruit milkshake. That's what I imagine when I see them. <laughs> when they look past the the machinery and hardware and stuff, that's what I can see. Oh my goodness, I just realized how big my ears are here. <laughs> How does it take me this notice with this first suit to realize how big my ears are? I'm gonna stop that. Next up we have Atlas. Would you get I actually really I really love this soda. Um and oh, I think for me it's gotta be something icy, okay? Because I got the, the white and I got the black. I can imagine like what was this? It's like vanilla ice cream, but you get like little like swirls of chocolate in it. I can imagine that. Um and they look they look heckin' adorable. Uh so I would hunt I, I feel like I I can't think of anything but the vanilla ice cream and um vanilla ice cream and like the cho you know like does, does anybody know that when there's like little chocolates um bits <laughs> in it? Maybe um with their eyes maybe Oh, maybe like a, a strawberry, like got a little bit of strawberry sauce in it. <laughs> oh man, what what happened to my life to, to the point where I'm I'm doing this? <laughs> this is gonna be very hard to explain to my parents. <laughs> Next up, we have Drake Blaze, which again, this is gonna be so out of the the blue here. But again, with Drake, with the kind of red and the kind of the kind of dark like grey and stuff like that. I'm gonna say I think they taste like a red hot chili pepper. I feel like I feel like you bite into Drake and they'll just you'll literally like it'll be like a ghost pepper and you'll be sweating for hours and you'll be like I can't taste anything else. So I definitely think that Drake would be would be a, a chili pepper. <laughs> um I I don't know. Um maybe it's also because the dragon thing, because it's like breathing fire and stuff, so maybe that's like an aspect of it. Maybe I'm being maybe <laughs> Maybe I'm being blinded by personas. <laughs> oh man. But am, am I wrong? Am I wrong to think that Drake's uh, a chili paper? 
pop it down below. Next up we have Miles, and I know Miles just came out with a new persona. Um, and oh, I definitely think with the pink, I think it'd be definitely easy to say like candy floss. But <laughs> with the orange tips, I'm trying to think what what would go, what kind of fruit would be going well with orange tips? Um, nobody say a thing, okay? You know what? You know what? I'm gonna say, you know, I, does anybody know? Was it like the Turkish delight sweets? When it's like you got like you bite into and it's like this kind of pink goo. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. I don't know what it is. It's in Turkish delights. People know this. People people must know this. Otherwise, this is gonna sound very odd. <laughs> but I can imagine. I think. I think again with the cat Sona and the colors and stuff. I definitely think that Miles could be a Turkish delight. Okay, Nippy Fox. Look at this little handsome bean. I definitely think that Nippy. Again, the easy answer would be cantaloupe. I think it's the pink. I think it's the pink. What other food is pink? I can't think of anything. <laughs> but I definitely think that they would be. Hmm. You know, you know when people get like pink gin. <laughs> I, 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 I don't know if this is what Nippy was expecting. But I definitely think that Nippy, <laughs> Nippy would taste like an alcoholic beverage. <laughs> I, I, I definitely think that they would taste like... I, I You know what? You know what? You know what? I'm going to stick by it. I think they're going to taste like pink gin. <laughs> I, I shouldn't have done this. I should not have done this. What made me think this was a good idea? <laughs> Next up we have Ollie. And Ollie, I feel like it's such a, a weird one, I'm thinking. I, I actually really love the Sona. I love the unique shape. Because uh, I think this is the first time I've seen Ollie Sona. Um... I, I, I think the first time I ever saw it, uh, saw the sauna, I couldn't stop thinking salad! <laughs> Which I'm so sorry, Ollie. I feel like, I feel like, um, like, I, I feel like you're gonna be like, oh my goodness, why have I got this? But I, I definitely, I don't know, I think it's the hair. I just imagine, like, somebody, like, nibbling your hair and being like, hmm, this tastes like leaves. <laughs> so, I, maybe, and you know what, you know, I think, I, you know what, I'm going to stick by it, I'm going to, you know what, you know what, we'll st you're going to do it, you're going to just stand up for what you you believe in. I I think Ollie would definitely taste like <laughs> salad. <laughs> but they are adorable though, look at that face, look at that face. You know what, actually, you know what, I think, I'm going to, you know, I'm going to double down here. I, I'm looking at the, the eyes, I'm thinking with the red, could be tomatoes, and like a little bit of like, the, the yellow peppers and stuff. I, I you know what? I'm doubling down. Salad. Ollie, you're a salad. <laughs> Next up we have Ritu. Ritu? Rit Ritu. Ret, Ritu? This little bean. <laughs> I'm just gonna say this little bean for the sake of it. Ritu, I'm gonna think Oh, this is a tricky one. Uh you know what you know when you get like a whole load of sugar? Like when you get the little sugar in top and like tubes or something like that and they're like all different colours. I do think that Reti just tastes like straight up sugar. <laughs> is that, I feel like, is that cheating? Is, is sugar technically like a flavouring rather than an actual food? Am I cheating here? <laughs> I don't want people to call me a liar in the comments. <laughs> clickbait, I've clickbaited everyone, I'm lying to you. <laughs> um. But yeah, I, I definitely think it's like one of those like flavoured sugar chips that people used to get when you just down it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Red Dude. Next up we have Undead Zombie Panda. And I already know pandas and I already know they taste toxic. So next one. But in all seriousness, uh pandas is definitely like I like the, the I always like their sauna with the like, black and white and the shifts and stuff. For pandas for sauna, I actually it actually reminds me of there's a there's a bar that's in Glasgow, which it used to serve like split shots. It used to have like one shot either side, and you can down them both at the same time. And that's what Pandos reminds me of. They remind me of a shot that's had the split in the middle, because there used to be stuff like they had iron brew like iron brew shots and like I don't know like tequila or something. I don't know. You're drunk when you have it, so <laughs> you don't think about the taste. But um, yeah, so. I definitely think that pandos would taste like a shot, but what what would they be on each side? 
I'm gonna say I'm gonna say pandas taste like tequila and oh, I'm gonna say oh, what's the other one? This is so difficult. Why? I I'm, I think I'm overthinking some of these already. Um, I'm gonna say. Goldschlager. <laughs> no, you're. Uh, um, Jaeger bombs. Jaeger bomb and tequila. You're a Jaeger bomb and tequila shot. <laughs> Pando, so I hope you hope you remember that. <laughs> okay, next up we have Vanguard and Vanguard. Two personality alone. They're very supportive. They're very lovely. They're they're so they're just so heckin' adorable. They're very. I feel like I feel like Vanguard's persona is extraordinarily extraordinarily. I can't speak. <laughs> well, I think with Vanguard's persona, I definitely feel like um, it's definitely going to be comfort food, but it's got to be like healthy comfort food because again, like I know they're they're actually a really really comfy streamer. Um, so I'm gonna say, you know what? This is gonna okay. This is gonna say weird, but I definitely think that Vanguard would taste like green tea. And now I'm going to have to explain this to people, <laughs> but. Do you, what do you guys think? Would for somebody that's like a comfortable like, like they're, they're very definitely like a, they've got like a, a persona that does look like they're very cuddly. But what do you guys think? Would does Vanguard suit green tea? <laughs> Comment down below. Next up we have Ty, and Ty's a really interesting one. I really like they've got their teeth. I'm a big teeth fan myself. And definitely like the colours with the black and um, and blue. I forgot the word for blue there. Uh, black and blue. I definitely think they look really, really nice. Um, I, I definitely feel like their food would be something cold. Because again, it's saber tooth, right? So it's got to be a little bit cold. Um, with the black. Hmm. <laughs> this, is a, this one's a tricky one, right? But you know what, actually, you know what, I'm going to twist this around a little bit. I'm going to say that they taste like licorice. And I feel like, I, this is, the excitement is going to make me sound so bad, but I'm not a big fan of licorice, but I know that there's a whole lot of people out there who love licorice. Um, and, but I like, I love your soda, but I, I just can't stop thinking that you taste like licorice. I don't know if it's, I don't know if it is just the, the black and the blue. Um, <laughs> I I feel like I'm gonna get like in the comments. I'm gonna have a whole lot of people like tell me how terrible my opinions are, and it's like, I can I listen to this wolf, but he doesn't even know what, what a real licorice tastes like. <laughs> but no, I, I definitely think Ty. What, am I am I wrong? Am I wrong here? Somebody somebody please tell me. <laughs> Next up we have Turtle Doll, and see with the, all the big colors again, Turtle Doll. It's really, really supportive. I love it. They're they've been in the community for a little bit now, and they're absolutely adorable. They're a little cute face. They got a little pinchable face, and I love that. Um, but you know what? I'm gonna say I'm gonna say that they'd be hmm. I I'm gonna say that they're jelly beans. I I, I definitely think they're definitely a jelly bean kind of persona. I can't think of anything else to be fair. Um, and I think jelly beans just suit them. I feel like, maybe, maybe I'm just hungry for jelly beans. I've gone from licorice to jelly beans. Somebody please, somebody please send us wolf jelly beans. Okay, next up we have Dear Mato. Don't say venison, don't say venison, don't say venison. Uh, I'm gonna say... Venison. But no, I, I definitely think that they've got like, I love their mug, I love the whole... Again, another supportive bean. I, I definitely think that they'd be something maybe comfort food wise. Uh, I love I love the purple hair. Again, being a purple bean myself, I do love a good purple hair. Um, uh, you know what? I, I definitely think that Dear Mato would be like a very fancy dessert. Like, you know one of the, the meals that you go in and um, that you go to a restaurant and it's like, it's almost like you have like an artistic dessert and you're like, you kind of you kind of don't want to eat it because you're like, oh, it looks amazing, but you're also like, but you also kind of want to eat it. <laughs> I don't know if it's just because see with the antlers, the antlers look really adorable. I love your little fluffy ears. I definitely think that. Um, oh, and your glasses. Yes, your glasses. Oh. 
Ah, man. <laughs> I, I definitely think that, you know what, you know what, I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. Dear Matto would be like a fancy cake. Like they've got like all this, like, like I said, all this kind of decoration on top and it looks beautiful. And <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe Dear Matto is just a beautiful bean, okay? Let's, let's just move on to the next one before I embarrass myself any further. Next up we have Reginald Whiskersworth. And yes, this is the, the, the picture they sent me. And that is the size. I've not readjusted anything. Yeah, with Reggie being so, so small, I definitely think they've got to be a small food as well, right? Um, so maybe like a fruit? Maybe, maybe a singular blueberry. I think that, I think it'd be like blueberry. But then again, if they're so small, <laughs> I was like, I was so tempted to say a raisin, but I thought, I, I, I'm not gonna say, I'm not gonna say that Reggie's a, a shriveled, wrinkly, old grape. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna stick by my original one. I think that with Reggie's personality, they're just so adorable and stuff. I'm 100% gonna say, I think they taste like grapes. No, wait, no, no grapes, blueberries. What am I talking about? What am I talking about? I'm talking about grapes. <laughs> No, I don't. I guys, I think I'm. I think I think I think I'm just sweating under this so much. I'm a sweaty mess. Okay, leave me alone. Next up, we have ferret magic, and again, ferret is one of those really really unique ones. I really really loved. I've always loved ferret's theme with the magic and the cape and the hat, and it's so freaking adorable. Um, so I definitely feel like I feel like. Given that they are magical, I feel like if you were to bite into them, it'd be like a completely different flavour than what you were expecting. You know what? I'm going to say they're going to taste like radioactiveness. Because <laughs> I feel like with the magical effect, if you were to bite into them, um, like I said, it would be the complete opposite from what you were expecting. Because it'd be like in disguise, but I feel like magic would taste a little bit radioactive. Definitely, <laughs> I I feel what what's been more insulting so far, uh, raisin, <laughs> raisin salad or uh, licorice or uh, radioactiveness. <laughs> really, I I can't think of anything else because I'm thinking what would be the opposite of what I think ferret would taste like. Um, and this is it. This is it. Let's 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 just move on. <laughs> okay, next up we have AC. And again, with icy, I feel like it's a little bit self-explanatory. They, I feel like they would taste like ice, but like I feel like um, I feel like they would taste like oh, with the blue. I feel like it'd be like you know, like I don't know, I don't know what it is like everywhere else, but you know, like the Tango Ice Blast or like the Aces or literally Aces. There's like um. It's like you've got syrup, so you've got like raspberry syrup and you've got it blended in with like the ice and stuff. That's what I think icy tastes like. I think they taste like a raspberry ice blast. <laughs> I, I don't even know if they still do raspberry ice blast, but that's what I'm coming with. <laughs> but what do you guys, what, what do you guys think? Do you think they'd either be like raspberry or do you think they'd just like taste like ice? Hit it up down below. Oh I guess I just noticed, I don't know why, I, did, I just noticed their shoes. I freaking love those shoes. AC, give me your shoes. I'm gonna steal your shoes. And finally, we have Barrett. Look at this little bean. I, I love the unique shape of this. I love the little tail. I love the little head that's so big. I love it, the eyes. I'm a big fan of big eyes. If you, like I said before, if you guys have got big eyes, big ears, or big tails, I love your soda. <laughs> but again, I think this one would definitely be an easy one. Definitely like vanilla ice cream, something like that. Um. With like little raspberry, with with again, like kind of rasp. I, I feel like I've been saying a lot of raspberry during this stream. Oh, you know what? No, I'm gonna say raspberry ripple ice cream. I think they would taste like raspberry ripple ice cream. Um, maybe oh, maybe with like a flake on the side, with maybe some Terry's chocolate orange thrown in. So maybe like, you definitely like raspberry and orange flavors. Ah, I'm I'm getting really hungry. <laughs> Actually, actually no, I'm gonna completely redcon that. I'm gonna say that they're gonna taste like coconut. I think they would definitely taste like coconut. Um, because again, I, I just noticed like with the fluff and stuff, I feel like they wouldn't be ice cream because they're too fluffy for that. What a thing! What what a thing to say. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I, I definitely think they'd be like coconut. Um, 
And, you know, I'm still going to say maybe like a little sauce, maybe like a little, maybe a little um, raspberry sauce with, with your coconut. I don't know. Does that go well? I don't know. But that's what I'm going to say. That's what I'm going to say for them. <laughs> I'm a, what do you guys think? What do you guys think down below? Thanks so much guys for reaching this far into the video. That is the end. Um, I know this was a really, really weird one. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I want to hear what your guys' opinion is right down in the comment section. Uh, I would honestly love to hear it. Are some of my, my predictions wrong? How offensive are they? Bark, 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 bark. <laughs> but if you fancy catching me over in any social media, that is them over there. And remember, you mattered yesterday, you mattered today, and you mattered tomorrow. I love every single one of you. Mwah!